Hello, friends, and welcome again to another Street Fighter Duel video. Time to fry! Time to fry, guys! Hello, guys, and welcome again to the channel. Uh, I just woke up, so good morning, good noon, good afternoon, good evening to everybody else from all around the world, wherever you're watching. And thank you all for your support for the last video. And in the last video, we did a giveaway, and it's not yet done yet, so you can go back and don't forget to put your in-game name in the comment. Whoever don't put doesn't put his, their in-game name, uh, it means they don't want to participate. This is how it goes. So don't forget to put your in-game name. If you commented already and you want to go in, just under your comment, comment again and put your uh, in-game name so I can include you in that. I know which i mean one jury is not uh, the the end of the world or it's not a big prize but it's something that i can give for the community and i think that it's a little bit a uh, good way of saying thank you because i can't offer that much anyway trendy guile is here so let's go and check trendy guile so is he thunder yeah thunder and assassin so he has high crit rate high crit damage high dodge high attack because he's an assassin, he's thunder, finally a thunder carry, and his fighting style is raging. It's th this one, the, the fashion. Iron dick, I mean iron will, perfect unit. Okay, let's go and check what iron dick, iron will is all about. Trendy guile. Whoa, what is this? 146 speed, right off the bat. Okay, okay, does his exclusive give this speed? No crit rate. Oh, more crit rate. Okay, he's worthy to get to plus 40, by the way, if somebody is asking. Because he has crit rate here. He has defense, attack, and HP, of course, like everybody else. But he has crit rate. Crit rate is everything in this game. He has high crit rate. This dude has high crit rate. 47% uh, with other fighting uh, spirits that you can put on him or fighting souls. It's fighting souls, my bad. This is the fighting spirit, right? This is the fighting spirit. The exclusive fighting spirit stats. This is the fighting soul. If you put broken formation on him, will perf uh, work uh, perfectly. Tyrant also will per work perfectly. So he gets his speed from the cards. And the cards, if you're, uh, if somebody doesn't know that, I'm gonna explain it. The first two cards are the PvP cards, and they give speed most of the time. So these cards, I guess. Uh, I don't know if they're PvP or not, but they are the speed cards most of the time. So seven. And 5, that's 13 speed and 13 here, of course, of course. So he gets 26 speed. Now, 146 is not faster than uh, Beast. Beast is basic 116 plus 50, so he goes to 166. But he's still decent, a powerhouse in speed and crit and the damage because he's an assassin. Perfect, perfect stats. So far, his stats are amazing here. That's how I analyze units. If you're looking like, how does Pika do testing? First, I read everything. Read is the most important thing. Read, guys. So let's go and check his skills. So he's a C1, C3 user. Flash kick, AOE. Okay. Charge and unleash a somersault kick that deals damage equal to 475% of attack to enemies in an area, which is good. I love me some AOE. If this fighter has at least four stacks of Sonic Saber, Okay, so they didn't say he gains Sonic Saber when he does the attack. It means by other means he will get them. Either by his other skills, or by his exclusive, or his cars, or his passive. Consume two stacks of, of the Sonic Saber and unleash one additional kick that deals damage equal to 248% uh, of attack to enemies in an area. Also AoE. So basically what he does, and this will always happen, because you will always have 4 stacks if you max him, because I'm gonna explain why, because these units with this mechanic are always gonna be buffing themselves. So he's gonna unleash 2 hits, so it's not 475%, it's 245-7% and plus 248% which is an insane damage in my opinion. This looks immediately for me like a bossing unit. So what does... Okay, so the sabers, basically, of Guile... This is Sonic Saber, this is different. Saber from Guile is ignoring 7% of defense to the enemies. Okay, and can't be dispelled. 
So let's check this. Sonic Saber, ignore 5% of the target's defense, which is less by 2%. Upon consuming a Sonic Saber, gain 5% damage bonus. Point. Wow. I say point because when they put point and then they don't say like a duration or interval, it means unlimited. Let's check this. Sonic Saber and its damage bonus effect can be stacked up to 5 times. Okay, they killed it here. So 5% by 5, that's 25% bonus damage and ignores 5% defense, which is great actually. But they didn't say it can't be dispelled, so it can be dispelled, he can be countered. Because I think they make him a little bit broken. At level 2, Somersault Kick and the additional kick have 100% base chance to inflict armor break. Perfect, he will always armor break. The additional kick only consume one stack of Sonic Saber, <laughs> not two stacks anymore. It says two stacks here. Great, his C1. So is it trigger? When this skill is in position two, no, it's a combo, so you can press it. So it's a single attack, unleashes three consecutive Sonic waves, dealing damage equal to 411 of attack. Each Sonic wave has a 30% base chance to inflict armor break and 30% to inflict shock, that's so low. Okay, at level 2 it becomes 45%, then it goes to 60%. Okay, that's decent. Actually, the C1 is decent if you want to enable Chun-Li, Guile, if you want to enable Kami, he works good with them. So, And he's a speedy unit, so you can put him on a lineup with Guile, and Guile will not be uh, lineup, uh, he will not have a slow lineup anymore. At level 4, increase the base chance to 70%, soul power at 40. That's decent, 10%, uh, I mean, that's decent for soul power. Okay, okay, his C3, and it's not a trigger, it's also, he can buff, what, okay, oh come on, don't give me another, uh, Ferris I got, not a buff, buffs are bad for carries, charge and unleash a supersonic wave that explodes and deal damage, wait, 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 wait. what do you mean, deal damage, okay, so charge is the buffing, and unleashing is the attack, so it's an attack, it's, is it single? To enemies in area. So it's an AoE. It's not a buff, guys. <laughs> they had us here. Good one, Top Joy. Good one. You try to fuck up always, but this time we caught you. Okay. If this fighter has at least three stacks of Sonic Saber, consume three stacks to summon... Whoa, that's too much consuming. To summon an illusion. Oh, that unleashes an additional supersonic wave that... Explodes to deal damage equal to 446% of attack to enemies in an area. So, okay, so he deals double the damage. This is actually because 554% and 546% that's almost a thousand percent. Okay, so it's a double damage. So he deals insane damage with his C3. So he's a okay, okay, this is a bossing unit 100%. The illusion super, the illusion supersonic. Wait, supersonic. What is this? This is flash kick. What's supersonic? Okay, when you unlock exclusive. Skill supersonic flash gain. Okay, the supersonic is here. The skill. His exclusive is the supersonic. Okay. You need we need to pay attention for every single detail. Consume three stacks and deals the damage. The illusion supersonic wave has a 90% base chance of like three armor break, three armor break. Okay, okay, okay. So the thing is, this is the great thing about it. So he gains uh, armor break. So he decreases defense by 3% for 15 seconds. And whenever you apply it, it reapply the 15 second. So you can get infinitely 10 stacks of armor break and continue moving on. 10 stacks with 3%, that's 30% ignoring defense. And he has 5, or re reducing the defense, so he reduced 30% for the enemy. And there's a 5% chance, which is goes, uh, ignores 5%, which is goes to 5 times. Which means 25%, ignoring defense. So he shreds. This unit is a bossing unit. Uh, mark my words, guys. This unit will be the bossing meta. Let's, I mean, they say small area of, uh, when they say small area, I get so much, uh, Panicking like it, it panics me. Okay, his exclusive Crit rate again perfect gain one saber sonic upon entering the battle and his his uh, passive says gain uh, Chance of obtaining two so you can have three. It's not that hard His assist skill takes effect with yeah, yeah 
When the battle begins, it grants the assisted fighter three Sonic Sabers. Okay, they don't consume. So the Sonic Sabers can be dispelled, but if you can't dispel them or the enemy can't dispel them, they will have them ultimately always. So they will buff, they can't consume, so they can't buff their damage bonus, but they will have 15% of ignoring damage defense. Put him, slap him on Guile. If you have him at SS, which is the minimum investment for him to work, you can put him on Guile with seven stacks of sabers on Guile. That's seven by seven. That's 49% ignore defense plus 15 ignore defense. Guile will be viable again, actually, which is crazy. So plus 10, Trendy Guile has a 20% chance to obtain one Sonic Saber whenever any other friendly fighter unleashes a combo. Okay, okay. He will have crazy amounts of Sonic Sabers or max. So we say it goes to 8 when his exclusive... What did they say here in his passive? His Sonic Saber goes 8 times. It's no longer 5 times. He can grant... It, he can go to 8 times. It means 40% chance of ignoring defense. 40% damage bonus he will get. This unit looks crazy on paper. Don't be like Aiden. Please, I beg you. Okay, at 20, gain two Sonic Saber upon entering battle. Immediately. So his minimum base uh, investment you want is the plus 20, 100%. At plus 30, Trendy Guile has a 50% chance to obtain another Sonic Saber whenever, whenever any other friendly fighter unleashes a combo. You need to get him to plus 30. You need to get him. He's, he's just like Guile. You need to be at plus 30. Okay, decent unit. His cars. Whenever Trendy Guile gains Sonic Saber, he also gains 5% damage reduction until the end of the... Wait, what? Okay, stacks until 40%. Woo! I thought it will... Okay, okay. So it has a cap. He will gain until it's 40%. Whenever Trendy Gal gains Sonic Saber, he also gains 5% crit damage until the end of the battle. Okay, okay, okay. God tier unit, here you go. We ask for something broken for Thunder. Here you go, you have it. This is the most broken unit in Thunder Faction. He's the top tier Thunder Faction now. If anybody will outscale Oni, if anybody will outscale Akuma, if anybody will outscale Viper, it's him. He inflict shock. He inflict armor break, he shreds defense, he, grain crit, he gains crit trait, crit damage, dodge, attack, damage, indefinitely. This guy can compete with Dalsim and Flame Adon, Fire Adon. This guy is insane. On paper, let's go and test him. Let's go and test him. Let's pick a battle here. Okay, F wait. F <laughs> okay, they might win us, but let's check his damage. I want to stack his damage, but this team can wipe us completely. So we're gonna just start. So we're gonna use Makoto for tanking because she's thunder. You, your thunder, and give me another thunder. Okay, you. But I don't want to use your C2. I'll use Makoto C2. So super C1 and C2, then his C3. Let's go. Let's check. Of course, we start first because they're all not speedy. Yeah. Okay. So, AUE? Wait, mate, that's not an AUE. Okay, okay, fucking descriptions. Oh my god, with this game. It's a single target or semi AUE. They always do that. It's, it triggers me. Okay, 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 okay. So, I, I hate when they when they say that. It's, it's not an AUE, it's a single target. Why are they saying AUE? Nice, nice auto attack. Okay, so here we go. Single target. Elena triggered. Good. And... Hit, kill. And hit again. Okay, okay. It's a single target. It's not AoE. They made it seem like an AoE because he continue attacking other units after he uh, he does his shenanigan. Okay, okay. It's a, it's a single target, not an AoE. Here you go. Standing beside each other. And he took the hit, died, then after he died, he continued attacking, the other one took a hit. So it's a single target multi-hitting unit. It's not AoE, it's semi-AoE. Decent damage, actually. Makoto almost did 1 million. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a... No, 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 hold back, hold back, hold back. Do you outscale Viper? I saw Viper here. 
Can Viper do better than him? Come, don't give me another on paper unit, okay? Come on, game. I, I wanna, I wanna get him maxed and test him for you guys. So let's go. So Viper, Elena, Viper just one shot people. Yeah, we know that. We know that. And let's go. Viper killed somebody. Of course she killed somebody. Of course she she freaking killed somebody. I don't want to curse a lot. I don't want to get demonetized. Okay, here we go. You. Oh, you kill with your CY. <laughs> Peace. Good job. So, how much did you do? Four million. Okay, okay. Yeah, I don't want to say stuff. Let's let's continue. Let's continue do testing. Okay, versus Oni. That's soul power. We should start first. We're faster than everybody. Yeah, we're faster than every. I mean, guy is fast. No, no, we have this guy. Okay, it's easy. Tanky, and yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Can you one shot able with your super from the start? No. Okay, give you some. C3. Okay, okay, okay. Decent damage. Oh my god. Insane damage, actually. That's good. That's good. That's what I expected from an OP unit on paper like that. Because you read his skills, it's crazy. It's ridiculous. Stop on. Stop. Stop, baby. You're not the. the you're not. The, oh my god. That illusion. Okay, so the illusion doesn't stay the entire time. Okay, but it, it just comes in, hit, and goes, so it doesn't die, so it will always trigger an illusion. Perfect. Okay, I, I stay safe. Okay, he, he's a bossing meta. If you can ramp up his damage, he will uh, crazy uh, go kill everybody else. Perfect, perfect. Do I want to summon for him? I don't know. I don't know. He might be the one to break my uh, my fasting on, sil on, 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 on not spending the tickets he seems crazy this video took longer than i wanted okay here we go bam bam wait a second and c3 dead oh you didn't ki ah second attack of course this is what they said by aoe flame Aidon. i use zangief so fire is not an issue for us to be honest yeah we, we don't give a single i'm not gonna say uh, bam, and dead, and the other one should die. Oh no, okay. Well, it's decent, it's decent. He's ramping up, how many sabers we have? Five. So damage bonus is eight, so far. Eight by five percent, oh, that's the forty percent, so he one shot here. Yes. Okay, and bam. Yep. Yep, he's a boss, he's slow. He's slow. If he does this attack and it takes so much time, he's a little bit slow. That's how we test. That's how we test. But it's not my optimal testing. What I will do is go to an account of my friends. My friend's account. I will go to their account. And I will take Guile. Maxed. Fully maxed. I'll hope that they will make him 36 cars. And first of all, I go to my... Uh, to my fighting uh, heart. And uh, I remove everything from Assassin. Cool. This is what I do, and I don't take any buffers. I take idling units that will not buff my team and use their shenanigans, or they buff specific types like Fei Long. I will use him with him because Fei Long can buff only Flame and can't buff him and use his C1. I will take somebody that uses his C2 for their own self, like Hugo, and I will use his C3. And this is how I conclude how good he is with his own self, with his own kit, with zero fighting spirit. It means only his levels, his FS, and his cars. This is how I do the testing. I will do that, and I will give you my verdict later. And yeah, that was it for the video. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. If you didn't, we thank you for watching. And as always, stay frosty. Peace. Time to fight. Time to fight.